Locally, the Hong Kong Alliance, which used to organize the city's annual June 4th vigil, will soon be history after members decided to dissolve the group this afternoon. But the security chief warned this doesn't mean authorities will stop their efforts to take action against the group. Caleb Long explains. The Hong Kong Alliance, in support of patriotic democratic movements of China, convened an emergency general meeting at the June 4th Museum in Mong Kok to decide on its future. Among the 45 member representatives present, 41 voted in favor of disbanding the alliance, while four voted against. The meeting also selected two people, including the group's former vice chair, Richard Tsui, as the group's liquidators. The alliance is now entering the winding up phase, and Tsui said it will ultimately be deleted from the company's registry. After the appointment of the liquidator today, the Standing Committee of the Hong Kong Alliance will cease to operate and no further activity and stand would be issued by the Hong Kong Alliance. So I added that it is sad to announce that the group is coming to an end. We all know and believe the stand of Bao Jun Fo already in every Hong Kong people's mind. I do believe Hong Kong people, no matter in individual capacity or other capacities, will continue to commemorate June 4 as before. Soy insisted that today's decision was solely decided by members of the alliance. We don't know the next step of the government or the police, uh, but certainly, uh, Every action uh, to be done by the police or the government towards any civil society organization uh, should be monitored by Hong Kong citizens. This morning, Secretary for Security Chris Tang was asked whether the government will revoke the alliance's company registration if it is disbanded. First of all, uh, we will look at the explanation given by the alliance and then uh, this is my responsibility to incorporate the explanation into my submission to the chief executive in council to decide um, whether um, uh, 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 we're going to um, request the uh, company registry to uh, delete the company from the list. Tang stressed that the dissolution has nothing to do with the government removing the alliance from the company's registry. Caleb Leung, TVB News.